What the hell is going on people? You see the title of the video today. We are jumping into the Halloween event. Well, the event, it's really just one. And then they have a bunch of other stuff going on. But the brand new ghostly prank, Recruit Super Saiyajin Gotenks and Ghost. But I see two ghosts in that picture, so that's weird. In the event, let's take a look at it, and we're just going to run it through, do every single stage. Um, available until November 11th. Defeat the bosses, Goku, Vegeta, and Piccolo for a chance to recruit an absurd plan. Super Saiyan, Gotenks, and Ghosts. Uh, Super Attack causes supreme damage with a high chance to stun the enemies. Uh, enemy. Surprise your opponents with the absurd Super Attack. You can also recruit Super Saiyan, Gotenks, and Ghosts by completing Trick or Treat Halloween Special Missions. Please check the announcements. Blah, 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 blah. So we're going to make a video when we actually rainbow this guy and just test him out on a bunch of different crews. See um, where he best fits and how much damage can he do. How good is this actual unit? Uh, you'll be randomly taken to one of the three paths li listed below when you land on a flying Nimbus at the end of the first crossroads. Path with training items, path with awakening medals, and path without items. So the shaft, the shaft road. Give it a shot and guess which of the paths are the ones with training items or awakening medals. So you're going to get one dragon stone for each stage. Um, you can only do that once. Blah, 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 blah. Let's jump straight into it. Let's see if there's multiple. Nope. Looks like it's only one one difficulty. We'll just use fusion team because why not? Fusion versus fusion. Alright, so a lot of different paths here. And it looks like we're jumping straight into... Yep. So we kind of have to use that right away. Um, I think I'm going to use the... Well, I'll go straight forward. I'll go straight forward. I'm wondering if it's completely random. We're going to find out. I wish they took out the threes on this map. Alright, cool. So I got awakening items. Can we get... We're just going to do two. Jump over this one. We're going to do one to get the gold awakening. And then, okay, so we get to get this one as well. That's not bad. Boom. And now we jump in here. Ghostly prank against Goku. Uh, guys, if you're free to play especially, I 100% recommend you do this event. If you're uh, looking on the left-hand side, you can see the rewards that you get for the special missions um, for this stuff. So it's definitely worth it. Um, no one that I can really give it to. He's not going to be able to super attack either, which is... Free. Well, no, that'll, that'll, that'll teach him. Now I can do it. Um, I actually don't need to give him all that green since he's already super attacking him. He will be able to super attack. These three should be able to smack these guys up. It's just hard, you know. 13 stamina. I like how we're facing an LR. <laughs> like, yo, stiff competition, bro. Stiff competition. You got an LR against us. It's a little unfair. But Gogeta's going to water hose him up. And then the Gotenks boy is going to throw some donut action at Piccolo. Ooh, 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 ooh. 1.6. Kritsky. And he had type disadvantage, which is always nice. Of course, Crit ignores all of that. So. First stage completed. Very, very easy. Very easy. Four missions complete. We'll take a look at and see what those are. And we got our one Dragon Stone. So that looks like that's the only stage available. So you just have to keep on running and running and running that area over and over and over again. So let's take a look at the missions that we got. Clear any stage three times. Okay. I did the other two um, hidden potentials because strength is going to be available the entire weekend and the physical one was up today so we did that we cleared 31 stamina which is nice and I believe there's you, you receive him for doing certain things so there it is recruit the specified character oops that's not it here it is so clear the event ghostly prank and recruit what's it called and you'll be able to get a second copy of him if you do that um, you clear it 10 times, you'll get a, a third. You clear it 15 times, you'll get a fourth. And then I believe that's probably it. Yep, looks like that's it. So let's keep doing it until we actually get a unit to drop. Because I believe it just says that, yeah, so there's a chance for it to drop. So let's run that again. 
and see if we can actually get a go tanks to drop for us and not give us the shaft come on brother I'm used to getting shafted on summons don't don't shaft me on on drops for uh, for a free to play card come on Bandai don't do this to me hey nice so that is completely random by the way and we're not gonna get a gold one either which is random as well all right so we're gonna get a bunch of low level awakening medals but hey sometimes it's worth it to have that sometimes it's worth it to get those so all right so the boy is gonna come in here and he's not gonna link up for poop but we got that so not a big deal we got that and I can yeah I'll give him this I mean it's it doesn't really matter this these dudes are just gonna wipe the floor with these Tough guys, these tough guys ain't so tough. Okay, you're going double, double super me. Come on, brother. I don't mind it. I don't mind it. I don't mind it at all. Hit him with it. Hit him with it. There they go. There they go. The buddy cop duo. Okay, so we finally got him. Nice. We finally got him. So let's take a look at the boy. Let's finish up this event and let's take a look at the boy. Do, 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 do. And we got another mission, which is probably the recruiting of him, which is awesome. So let's take a look. Up. Oh, let's let's grab the mission first. Let's grab the little the little doobie. The little doopy. There he is. So he is intelligence, if I remember correctly. Go all the way to the bottom, which is probably where he is, somewhere around here. He's a new card, so it's it's automatic. Oh, there he is. Okay. So we can just do this. Lock the boy up, and let's take a look. So fusion category, keep us to HP, attack, and defense, 30%. Reminds me of the physical UI Goku, who's like a uh, Realm of Gods leader. An absurd plan. So Super Ghost Kamikaze Attack causes supreme damage uh, with a high chance to stun the enemy. So that's about 50%. That's not bad at all. We we'll take a look at the details. Um, so, okay. Not terrible. Not terrible. And then if we look at his stats, randomly changes key spheres of a certain type to rainbow key. Recovers 6,666 HP per rainbow key sphere obtained. Recovers HP with candy. Okay, the candy thing is pretty terrible. You're obviously just trying to bring him to the Boo event, Maj Boo event. But the randomly changes key spheres is really strange. Um, that's actually really good if you pair him next to Super Saiyan 3 Goku who loves rainbow key spheres uh, And potentially you can even throw him on a fusion team because realistically uh, LR Gogeta loves rainbow key as well, so that's actually not a bad passive to have and For doing 6666. I mean it, it is what it is. You're probably not gonna be giving him the rainbow key. So whatever golden warrior which is key plus one, enemy defense minus 2,000. Super Saiyan, which is attack 10%. Uh, prepared for battle. All right, key plus two. The Innocence, attack 10%. Fused Fighter, key plus two. And the Saiyan Lineage, key plus one. So you're not going to need any kind of key for this dude. He is on Fusion and he is on Hybrid Saiyans. Now the question and I believe I already know the answer to it, but let's see if you can put them with everyone else. Let's take a look. Where's the boy? There he is. With all the other Gotenks. Yes, you can. Yes, you can. And it's all because of and Ghost. You change the name to, to what it is, and immediately you can use him on the squad. So that is very nice to see. Let me just put back my... Uh, all right, cool. So that is the new Super Saiyan Go Tanks and Ghost. That is the event. You just have to run it a million times to be able to get copies of him, which is pretty darn cool. If we take a look 
at the other story events that are going on. Kind of got a lot going on. You got the ghostly prank, obviously. And then you have the Z Fighter arc still going on, the Ginyu Force stuff, the Trick or Treat Majin Buu, and then you get the strike events for the day. You got the other worlds, um, which you can still farm for Pycon hats. You got the low class warrior Raditz, which you definitely uh, should farm in Rainbow if you're planning on running the world tournament and go far. You got the Bojack event, so if you're trying to level up or, uh, you know, LR Bojack, it's the best place to go. And then obviously the free to play Bulma, who's actually a decent tech unit. Let me know in the comments below if you've already rainbowed the boy. You know, I'm going to have him rainbowed probably by tomorrow, maybe. I think that would probably take me about a day. But either way, don't forget to lightly, gently, and accurately massage that like button. As always, this is Periodic, saying see ya.